Hello everyone and welcome to Star Wars on High. Thank you for stopping by. We are finally here at the eve of Andor. Tomorrow morning we'll be getting the first three episodes which all tie together to make up what is considered a movie that starts the beginning of the show. This will include flashbacks to Cassian's life as a child and how he worked his way into the Empire. I do not think we'll be seeing any of Mon Mothma in these first three episodes because I assume that it's supposed to focus on Cassian first, but that is just a guess. I follow several people on Twitter that went to the premiere and saw the first three episodes and I've actively been avoiding them because I don't want to know too much. All I've really seen is high praise for the show and I'm very much looking forward to it. Given what we've seen in the trailer so far, they haven't showed us a lot of anything and if it follows the pattern that every other Star Wars show has given us, then everything in these trailers will only be for the first four or five episodes if I had to guess. Which means we're going to be seeing some action, some clone troopers, it's going to be a great time. As far as what I'm hoping for, I'm not really sure. Sure. I don't have a lot of excitement for this show, but at the same time, I really can't wait to watch it. They've done such a great job at keeping it secret that we really don't know what to expect besides the obvious, but even then, it's very much left up to interpretation. Right now, from what we've seen in the trailers, I'm very interested in learning where Cassian came from and what the Empire did to his home planet that pushed him to join their ranks and take them down from the inside. I also have so many questions about Stellan Skarsgård's character Luthen Rail, as he feels like a type of character that we haven't seen before. For. He's almost like a combination of both Mon Mothma and Saw Gerrera. Just based on the trailers, we've got one scene with him in his Senate attire and being prim and proper, and the next he's taking out TIE Fighters and smuggling items through Cassian. As far as other characters go, I'm obviously excited to get more Mon Mothma because her character is very lacking. Every time she's on screen, she hardly gets any time to do anything, so having a show that will focus on her is going to be great. On top of this, I'm also interested in seeing how much screen time Saw Gerrera is going to get as as he's in the same boat as Mon Mothma aside from the animated series he's a part of. The next big thing that has my interest is a rumor that I've seen thrown around a bit, and I'm not too sure if it's real, but it could be true. Now, for anyone who doesn't want any spoilers, this is your chance to skip ahead to this point in the video, but I won't be giving out any real names or details because there isn't much to this rumor. But, just in case, you've been warned. I've seen some comments about the potential of a certain comic book character appearing in this show, and it could be a bombshell of a drop that will cause an uproar on both sides of the fandom, giving us those who will love it and those who will despise it. But as far as who that character is, I have no idea. But if I get to vote on somebody to be this character, I definitely would love to see Dr. Aphra finally make an on-screen appearance. She is such a unique character and I think she could bring a lot to this show. Overall, I think we are in for a treat and we may be about to receive one of the very best pieces of Star Wars media yet. Also real quick, I'm sure a lot of you saw this fake video that I made acting like some YouTubers from the Fandom Menace site of things. That was a social experiment that I will follow up on here in a few days with another video, so stick around to see the results that my test concluded. But until then, we just have one more day until Andor, so let us know down in the comments, will you be staying up to watch all three episodes? It will drop Wednesday at 3 a.m. Eastern Time, so I will definitely be watching it in the morning, but be sure to let us know what your plans are. As always, thank you to those who stuck around to this point in the video, and we hope to see you again very soon.